I was 12 years old the last time I saw him. He left one night for a bottle of Southern Comfort and didn't come back. While I've been away, he married you, the West Texas girl, the type with the soft, reassuring voice, his very own Southern Comfort. As soon as my stint at the ward finished, I looked for him. Mama was always the religious one. Doing this, it's what she would have wanted. Where in North Bay? Okay, which neighborhood? C A N T. When was this? Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna use this for the lead. Two minutes, is that okay? Perfect, thank you, Darlene. Hi, Michael. We got a breaker here. Is it the lead? Most likely. Hostage situation in North Bay, but you may need a read of coal. Nothing I can't handle. <laughs> Thanks, sweetheart. Good luck. One minute. That's my lead, you've got 60 seconds. You just came in? Still warm. What's the story? Break in, potential 1032, quiet neighborhood. Very, uh, very good guy. No, no, it was cancer, I think. Well, it was only 68, poor guy. 45 seconds. What is it? This, this neighborhood, it, it's by Mike's house. Run it. Run it? It's breaking and we're on the scene. Darlene, are there any other rigs there? No, none yet. Run the story. Linda, it's his neighborhood, his home 15 is seconds. We go to Darlene in 15. Stand by camera two. You're really gonna run this in that neighborhood? It's, it's 10 seconds. You type the rest of that toss, you've typed your last sentence at this station. I can't. Take open, ready camera two. <laughs> Ready, Michael? Breaking news out of Canterbury Hills today. Good evening, I'm Michael Anderson. A woman is being held hostage in her North Bay home. For the latest on the story, we go to Darlene Mathers. Darlene, what can you tell us? And take Darlene. Michael, I'm here in Canterbury Hills where authorities are taping off the 10,000 block of Egan Street. We haven't yet learned the name of the suspect. So police were on the phone. Get back to Michael here. Tonight. Ready, Michael? Five, reporting death threats and violence inside the house. Michael. Excuse me, did you say, is this the 1000 block of Egan? Yes, the 10,000 block of Egan between Jefferson hey, and Lincoln Street. Can I get a better visual of the house you're standing in front of? Yes. Uh, if you take a look here, we can't see inside the house what's happening, uh, though the suspect is believed to have hold of a female hostage and possibly wielding a weapon. Do you intend to hurt me? That's what this is about. I can promise you, Polly. This is not what you want. I promise you it isn't. I don't know what you've been through. I can't imagine what it would have been like living in that awful place all that time being watched over, tested. I wouldn't be able to even begin comprehending what you're going through, Polly. What you went through. Okay, we have a visual of the man in the house. Down. If we could bring you any closer here, unfortunately, the man has a sign. Come home, Michael. Come home, Michael. Uh, ordering the man to put the weapon Back to Michael. Down Ready, Michael. You're on, Michael. 
That man, he's, he's got my wife. Michael, I'm sorry, did you say that the woman inside is- She's my wife. That's, I think, oh, oh God, Holy. And the man with her? My son. Ladies and gentlemen, I, I apologize. If you, if you excuse me, there's, I think, uh, I must, I, I think, uh, I must. Where is he going? Damn it, if he leaves you, Todd, go to break, shit. Mike, Mike, what, what's happening? You have a son? You gotta talk to me, man, what's going on? What's going on? What's happening right now is that Mary, is a hostage being held by my son, who I haven't seen or heard from or spoken to in years. Polly, you don't have to do this. Listen to me. I know your father. He's not a perfect man. But we are perfect people. Are you perfect? Do you make mistakes? Son, listen. I'm sorry that if you've been wrong, truly I am. I, I don't know what happened between you and between you and him. He never speaks of it. tried to understand, I have, but it's complicated, I would imagine, and Polly, I know where you come from, you come from a man who, deep down, he has a good heart, I know, Polly, I know you have that heart, too. Will you talk to me? Why don't you tell me what happened? I can listen. I can listen to you, Polly. Tell me what happened. I was 12 years old the last time I saw him. What are you going to do? Something I should have done 20 years ago. 